Thousands of people travel to Des Moines tonight to kick off the state fair with the annual parade through downtown. Yeah, KCCI's Max Deak Knight joins us now in the studio and Max downtown Des Moines was a place to be. Yeah, Stephen Stacy, you could already feel the excitement for the state fair tonight downtown. People came from all over the state to be at tonight's parade, but they all say they're here in Des Moines for the same reason. It's amazing. We love it. It's a tradition for us. So much rides and so much candy. <laughs> it's a pretty big deal. A pretty big deal may be an understatement. Just look at this crowd. It wouldn't be the State Fair without the State Fair Parade, and it wouldn't be a State Fair Parade without a bunch of excited kids. Just take it from one-year-old Mariah. Mama. Mama. Hey, she's ready to report. 2019 is Mariah's very first State Fair Parade. The parade may be an old tradition, but it welcomes the young with open arms. This was something that we done every year since I was, since I can remember. So now it's my grandkids, my daughters, my granddaughters. <laughs> Making memories together as a family. People here say that's what the fair is really all about. And if you ever wanted to catch a glimpse of age old traditions, meeting new ones, well, the fairgrounds await you. Me and my mom have this tradition where um, just, um, we just go every year to the fair, just me and my mom. I think it, it's just your roots and um, it takes you back to, you know, the agriculture and the farming and, and everything that Iowa stands for. And it's such a positive uh, thing for families to do together. And the fairgrounds open tomorrow at seven o'clock in the morning. And Steve, I'll see you there, right? Yes, you will. I will be there as always. KCCI's coverage for the Iowa State Fair runs deep, deep. We have been broadcasting live from the fair for decades now, even before we were KCCI. Back in the days when the call letters were KRNT, we introduced television to fairgoers in 1946. Uh, the picture you saw earlier was taken from the fair's communications building in the 1950s. We then moved shows outside. There were some pictures there from the 1980s when we all had the Iowa spirit and we handed out those hats just to prove it. We have quite a state fair history here at KCCI and it will continue for years to come. That's why we are Iowa's news leader. In fact, this will be my 25th year anchoring our five o'clock newscast from the state fair. I can't believe it. Yeah, and it'll be my first and I, I am so excited. Thank you. I'm it's excited cool. to be part of this tradition and you can catch KCCI 8 News at 5 live from the Mid-American Energy Stage every weekday of the fair. We'll have musical acts. We'll talk about the fair food and the news headlines and your fair forecast from meteorologist Riley O'Connor. That starts tomorrow. Come on out and see us.